Suppose you want to withdraw 5000 to pay your tuition during each of the next three years, but you start right away to make the first uh, withdrawal or the first payment. You take it out today, and so it's 5000 that uh, live today, and then uh, we have three withdrawals, uh, withdrawals of uh, 5000 each. So we would like to know how much you have to deposit today. We have our time for three years. Our interest rate is the 4% per year. The question becomes what's the present value in this case this is also an annuity because we have 5000 for each of the next uh, three years i could enter this as a negative number if we if we think we have to uh, withdraw and then uh, we have no money left over and the question becomes uh, what's our future value what's our present value so we use a function called pre-pv our interest rate is uh, 4%, our number of periods is 3, our uh, payment is 5,000, we are going to be withdrawing for each of the next 3 years 5,000, no money left over, and here is where we change because the first payment takes place right away, so we change the function to the beginning of the period, so we go with 1 as our uh, predetermined, so in the previous cases if you are solving for an ordinary annuity you just don't do anything to the, by default you just leave it in zero, but if it's an annuity due, you have to make the first payment beginning immediately. You have to change this to one. When you do that, you find that you need to deposit 14, 430 today in order to be able to withdraw 5,000 for each of the next three years if that money is growing at 4%.